Note the plaque buildup around the bands and brackets and along the gum line. Our objective is to thoroughly remove all of it. With the brush bristles angled approximately 45 degrees downward, make small circular motions while moving the brush forward. Angle the brush bristles approximately 45 degrees upward and again make small circular motions while moving the brush forward. Using the same brush head angles in motion, clean the remaining teeth until all buildup is removed. Pass the floss and threader up between two teeth. Slide the floss back and forth several times cleaning the surfaces of these teeth. Be sure to clean below the gum line. For the lower, pass the floss and threader upwards from inside and below the arch wire. Again, be sure to clean below the gum line. Remove the floss and threader. The proxy brush is a nylon bristled brush intended to clean in between the teeth. Place it under the arch wire in between two teeth, then move it up and down, cleaning the edge of the bracket toward the back, in between the two teeth, then the edge of the bracket toward the front. Roll a piece of wax into a ball about the size of a pea. Press it onto the bracket, which is irritating the cheek. Be sure to include the pokey wire as well as the bracket. If a bracket toward the front is irritating the lip, follow the same procedure. In either case, be sure to call the office to arrange an appointment to get the problem resolved. Avoiding hard and chewy food is important as loosening a bracket will lengthen treatment time. Hard or chewy food can loosen a bracket and there are several steps to repair the damage. The arch wire and loosened bracket are removed. The enamel surface is cleaned. then prepared. Sealant is applied and a new bracket with adhesive is placed. Then light cured to harden the adhesive. And finally the arch wire is replaced. Hard or chewy food can bend the arch wire moving the teeth and since it is a spring, it can move teeth in the wrong direction.